to Rob with the forecast in the fire zone and Rob we know a major climate change report was released this morning. That's right, uh, Michael. The U.N. put out their climate uh, change report. The last one came out in 2013, the last full one. This one says that unequivocally humans are causing climate change and that some of our most extreme weather events have a direct link to that climate change. Case in point, these fires, six of the biggest seven fires in California history have occurred in the last 12 months alone. And the smoke from the fires that are happening right now, so thick, getting all the way into Colorado. Look at this video coming out of Colorado Springs. It is so dense there, so the air quality is so poor in Denver that the Broncos had to move their practice indoors. On Saturday, Denver was the most polluted uh, air quality city in the world. And it, it, this is all from, mostly from the fires that are burning in California. Look at the expanse of this. It goes all the way into the Midwest and the Great Lakes as well. So, so many Americans are suffering from this wide-reaching impact from these fires alone. And yes, it does have a climate change influence, as does the heat that's going to be spreading across the country this week. Heat waves on both coasts, including the northwest, where temperatures will get to near record breaking levels again in Portland. This is just six weeks after that deadly heat wave in June, and we're going to get close to some of those numbers once again. And that, too, has a strong climate change link. Michael, definitely you can see that all across the country, all across the country. around the world. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.